All right, you guys, so after you have completed your six missions being the leader and then also doing the equipment resupply, so you'd have to physically solo go out and then go find some supplies somewhere, use the forklift, get that stuff hooked up, and then deliver it back here, okay? So what we're going to be doing here is fully upgrading the MTL, and then, of course, we have a delivery vehicle. We actually have two delivery vehicles here, I believe. One is going to be the Manchester and the other one is going to be that RV that's behind me. All right, guys, so right here, this is locked because we're going to have to complete 10 of Dax missions, okay? So each mission will take, uh, I believe, 48 minutes before you can start the next one. So this is something that you guys are going to want to start on early when you get over here in Unlock Dax and then just do those 10 missions and you will unlock this right here which is uh, what I'm working on right now. So anyways, from there, you guys, we're just going to go through here, and I'm going to fully upgrade this vehicle right now because this is a brand-new service vehicle that just came into the game, and I wanted to show you guys uh, what this thing has to offer. So you don't need to own a Brickade because we stole this vehicle off of the train. All right, so for bumpers, I noticed that it did have some... Okay, I don't want that one. I'll take this one, though, just in case you have to bash into some cars or something like that where you're driving around. I wonder what would win in a, in a, like, a demolition derby. Would it be this or would it be the terabyte? Who knows? All right, guys, we're just moving on through here, getting the most important stuff here that we can. Pretty cool that we do get another uh, service vehicle in the game. The Mobile Acid Lab, and I'm hoping to get this thing fully upgraded and fully stocked so I can see what the maximum amount of pay that a person would be getting while you're doing this. All right, so anyways, from there, we're just going through here. So here's the liveries right here. And you can see uh, a lot of different liveries. There's like a, a, a map of the world right there. And then the humane labs, and this is the livery that it kind of came with when we stole it. And then here's this one right here. This is the, um, I don't know, the dildo dude one. So anyways, from there, you guys can just decide which one is your favorite. I kind of like the Humane Lab one because this is particularly a Humane Labs vehicle that we stole. But now it's ours to operate and run. All right. So we're also going to be upgrading that Manchez. Now that Manchez came with it. So I didn't have to buy any of this stuff. So this is just stuff that came with it. But the thing that I did have to buy is the actual uh, lab itself, which did cost $750,000 just to go ahead and set this vehicle up, basically. So the vehicle was free, but the lab itself cost $750,000. And then we'll be talking about more things when I do fully upgrade these vehicles. We'll be going inside of the vehicle here, the MTL Brigade after I fully upgrade this. Now for tires, what's really cool here is you guys can put like a whole bunch of different tires on here, rims it seems. But it doesn't look like it's a Binnie's. And you're definitely uh, going to have to do some sort of glitch if you wanted to get some F1s or something on here. All right, you guys. So from there, it looks like that vehicle has been fully upgraded and is now ready to be operated by myself. So from here, we get this delivery vehicle. And this delivery vehicle, it's not new. And this is just something that we get to use while doing, I would say, small deliveries in the game. And I think the RV is a delivery vehicle too, but I don't I don't know exactly yet because I haven't I haven't had the chance to use it yet. So we're just gonna go through here real quick and fully upgrade this vehicle. Man, I'm confused. And then, you know, if you guys already have a Manchez, it looks like you're going to have to go in here and upgrade this because this is going to be considered a delivery vehicle. Uh, although, particularly, I'm going to try to steer clear of this because I've already done a cell mission with this bike. And it did have me going to a lot of locations and actually physically getting off the bike and happening to deliver something to another location. Uh, not very far from the bike. It's just it required me, you know, to deliver something up to a doorstep or a mailbox or something like that. So we're just going to go ahead and fully upgrade this bike. I don't want anything bad to happen to this thing. I want this thing to be fully upgraded just in case I ever had to use it. But particularly if you guys just plan on doing nothing but big sales, you don't have to waste a whole bunch of money upgrading this. And just remember too, like this is, um, you know, a vehicle, so it can take damage. So particularly you'd want to put more armor on it and then getting around the map a lot faster. 
you know, making sure that it has a good engine and stuff like that. But this vehicle right here, it does have a lot of customizations, as you guys can see. And then it'll be up to you whether you guys want to upgrade this stuff or not and put the extra stuff on here. All right, so here's a really cool livery. And I think some of this stuff might be new. I'm not really sure. I don't own a Manchester normally. I think I accidentally got rid of it when I was doing some dupes. All right, but anyways, from there, here's some liveries right here. I kind of like this one. Yeah, most definitely. I like that one right there. It's like black light sensitive or something like that. Cool. Just going through here and getting all the good stuff that we need. All right, so almost done. Yeah, I think we're done. So there we go, you guys. We got two vehicles right here that I was able to unlock by doing the six missions. And once again, you don't need to like buy a brickade. But let's go inside this thing real quick. Now check this out. This is crazy from the outside to what the inside looks like, okay? So inside of here, because then since I've already purchased my acid lab, there's the acid lab right there. I, I believe Mutt is going to be in here, and there's going to be some features that I wanted to go ahead and talk about as well after you guys go ahead and unlock this for yourself. So there's the acid lab right there. Kind of crazy. Always be here, head down, making the miracles happen. I can't make acid out of thin air, though. All right, I this is cool, huh? College thesis. I'll keep the supplies over here in this corner. But so the area over here is way. going to be to for our stock, which is going to be Got this is going to be like the supplies right here. Okay, so we got our stuff. supplies on the just left side. Up, you can yeah? see like all that filled up right there. It looks like a lot, so you're definitely now, going to want to keep that filled up. And then when this like spot over here fills up, of course we'll be ready to be able to make some cells in the game. And it looks like there is a quite a bit of stuff that can go up over there and one thing that i was wondering is what is the maximum amount because it did say with that unlock of doing 10 dax jobs it would increase a bunch of stuff and i don't know exactly what it's going to do but preferably make things better and then check this out over here okay so we've got this little weird table right here so if you guys go up to this and you mess with this you can do this like once a day i believe and it will actually boost your production of lsd so you're gonna be able to produce even more a lot faster but potentially you're not gonna be able to do that uh once every day so there we go, guys. Here's a good breakdown of what's going on inside of the brocade. And then here's Mutt right here. Okay. And then there's a couple different things you guys can be doing. So to like resupply this thing, you can pay for resupplies, which cost $60,000, which I'm assuming it's going to cost uh, a little bit. But you can see there's meters in the bottom right hand corner down there for how much stock and how much uh, other stuff that it is and then how much money potentially it would be worth in the game and i'm curious to having this vehicle fully upgraded and then from there seeing how much it would actually be worth to have a full stock and then sell that so here's just some other things that i wanted to go ahead and talk about like inside so right here i'm just going to do this little drippy thing and this is going to boost my speed of production okay so this is definitely something you guys are going to want to be taking care of if this is something that you plan on doing for like a normal grind in the game which is producing lsd and or selling it in the game and then once again you're definitely if you plan on doing this is do those 10 dax missions which unfortunate each time that you guys can do the dax Whoa, mission is every 50 minutes game. before we get to do another one and like right now i've already done i think about four or five of them so i've got a couple a few more to do before i get to unlock that but i'll be making a video talking about that as well and more videos talking about this even if this adventure itself is worth taking um you know because right here okay so we can either source it ourselves and sourcing it ourselves does not get very much stuff so think about it like whether you're going to go to your bunker and you're going to buy supplies for your bunker or are you going to go out and source stuff for your bunker which takes you know an enormous amount of time sometimes and from there you guys like seriously um We'll just have to wait and see if this is going to be worth the money grind, I would say. And preferably for me, I would just rather pay for stock so this just fills up. And then hopefully I'll be able to fix this up here and uh, get the upgrades soon enough to where we can get full production here going on. And then see how much money a full stocked... Uh, Ricade with LSD is worth in the game. So anyways, from there, if you guys enjoyed the video and it was helpful, hit that like button on the way out, subscribe for more content, and thanks for watching. My name is Gravesight, and I will see you in the next one. So peace.